New to FeatureCam 2019 is Directed Automatic Feature Recognition, which is an alternative to Automatic Feature Recognition, or AFR. AFR automatically recognizes the features in a specific setup, mapping them to the corresponding part geometry. However, as you can see, since AFR uses multiple Z levels to calculate features, this can increase the machining time. If we fast forward through a centerline simulation, we can then display a total machining time in our results bar of 50 minutes and 21 seconds. This is where the benefits of the newly available Directed Automatic Feature Recognition, or Directed AFR, can be witnessed. Using Directed AFR, we can pre-select any of the variety of features we want to recognize, not selecting any feature types we don't want. We can specify parameters for the available features, choosing to include or exclude depending on certain dimensions, and then selecting which recognized features we want to include. This time we'll run through a 3D simulation to witness the physical results. Since the multiple Z levels aren't used as part of the algorithm, we can witness a shorter machining time. Using directed AFR, we have now achieved a shorter machining time of 38 minutes and 58 seconds. This also decreases programming time when compared to extracting with feature recognition. Index directed AFR can also be used for milling features on a turn mill part, capable of specifying index and B axis angles. Once again, we can select the features we would like to recognize, then specify a B angle around the index axis. In this case, we'll be use 90 degrees. This locates the rest of the features we wish to program. Using directed AFR once again saves us programming time to extraction with feature recognition, and we can now run another 3D simulation to witness the physical results. The ability to use index directed AFR around a terminal part gives us an additional dimension to our programming capabilities.